Hello everyone, in this video I will try to share to you guys how I create uh, some summary data on my Firebase database with Flutterflow. So uh, as we know, that's uh, quite simple and easy to get summary data with a SQL database, right? Um, but that's definitely different and uh, more uh, difficult when you are using no SQL database like a Firebase. As you can see, I have this view with the detail of my collection and uh, and above of the list view I have the total of my spending which in this case the total from this uh, total collection I will jump to the Firebase uh, as you can see I have a transaction collection which I have three documents and in the documents I have a uh, three field that's a dot store and totals which I retrieve in my app so to making it more clear this is a uh, step by step I create these things so first of all I create a uh, two pets that which is index total and total spending after that when the pets loads I set a uh, dot spot uh, value to zero, and the next step is I add action to querying a cone for my transaction collection, which in this case I will get a tree. After that, I querying uh, data to get of all my collection data. So the next step is I add some loop condition and the uh, condition is as long as the index total bad state is uh, less than or equals for uh, from query count. Uh, so do this action. This action is I will set the total spending value with total spending itself value and plus with total from the collection at the specific index which is the index is the index total and after that I will add a plus one to index total value so so this is uh, how it looks like in the fire the, in the flutter flow I mean So the first thing I create a two pad state and when page reload I set a uh, for two pad state value to zero and I'm querying for cone uh, the collection querying for get the list document from my collection and I add some loop condition you know uh, at uh, at loop and for the condition I said uh, for first value index total less than or equal second value is uh, the count transaction the count transaction is the Firestore query for get the count of my collection and um, I set the app state page state for total spending with a uh, code expression which is uh, this thing and for variable one, I uh, put from total spending itself, and for variable two, I put from a uh, total from the collection with uh, in the specific index, 
and I choose document properties uh, with a total. Okay, so when I get uh, the total spending and I put uh, or I store to total spending apps that so I set the this widget text widget with a value from the patch that okay uh, everyone I hope you understand what I said thank you for watching this video